So the good news for people of Maharashtra, Mumbai, and everywhere around here is that cinemas are now open. It's a day movie buffs have been waiting for, exhibitors have been waiting for. Joining me is Mr. Chandresh Daftari, who is the Regional Director of Operations of Western Region of PVR. Uh, congratulations, very big day for you as well. Thank you so much, Rohit, and thank you so much for having me on the show. Absolutely, it's a big day. In fact, uh, I would like to start by thanking the government of Maharashtra for having allowed cinemas to reopen. Uh, big day because, you know, Maharashtra is such an important part of the film industry ecosystem. Right. And uh, also because of the fact that, you know, uh, PBR uh, has the largest presence uh, in, in the state of Maharashtra. You know, we operate 40 properties with 165 screens out of the total KT of 855 screens screens that PBR operates across the length and breadth of the country. Yeah. Maharashtra continues uh, to enjoy the largest share uh, of that kitty. Right. So, you know, for the viewers on NDTV who are watching this right now, uh, what do you want to tell them? Firstly, do you want to tell them to come back to the cinemas? <laughs> oh, absolutely. All I would uh, request the viewers is that please do come and uh, enjoy movies at your uh, nearest uh, favorite PBR cinema. One thing that I would also like to assure uh, your viewers is that uh, cinema is the safest uh, place to visit. Uh, each of uh, our staff working at the PBR property is fully vaccinated. We've taken off, uh, uh, taken all the possible precautions. Uh, we've gone above and beyond the government mandated uh, SOPs, uh, COVID-led protocols. So absolutely, cinema is the safest uh, place for uh, people to visit. Right. So, um, what are the SOPs? If you can give the viewers an idea, can we, uh, can you know, uh, can a group of people come? Are they sitting together? Are they eating inside? What are the new SOPs? Uh, so, the SOP clearly mandates in the, in the state of Maharashtra right now, government has allowed to reopen cinemas from today with 50% capacity. 50%. And 50% capacity is with uh, checkered seating. What it means is that we have to block one seat. Uh, one alternate seat. Okay. So uh, after every one seat, uh, we have to block one seat. So people, uh, obviously our guests can't be seated together. Uh, they have to leave one seat uh, vacant. And also on the FNB side, uh, right now, uh, people, uh, our guests would not be allowed to take uh, their favorite uh, meal and the popcorn inside the auditorium. Uh, but what we have done is that we have been extremely mindful of the fact that uh, the whole cinematic experience is uh, incomplete without people enjoying their favorite popcorn. What we've done is that we've been mindful of the fact uh, that people need to uh, enjoy their favorite meal. So what we've done, we've elongated. We've had longer intervals okay. across all the cinemas that we would be operating in this state. So we've made sure that we have uh, about a 20-minute interval so okay. people can easily come out during interval, enjoy their meal, and then go back uh, to watch the movie. Right, and FNB is one of the main sources of income as well for all the exhibitors uh, across the country. So, uh, what you know, releases wise, the big releases have piled up one after another. What are the releases that uh, exhibitors like yourself are looking forward to, so that the people come to the cinemas? Uh, so two things uh, that we've done uh, on the release uh, uh, side, you know, so one good thing is that from the date uh, the government announced, uh, you know, cinemas to reopen in the state of Maharashtra, within a span of 48 hours, 20 tentpole Bollywood movies got announced in that span yeah, of two yeah. days. So that's something which has never happened in the past. So clearly, you know, uh, all the producers who've been waiting on the sidelines, waiting for cinemas to reopen in the state of Maharashtra had uh, announced their movie lineup. What we have done at TVR is that since this is uh, day one of uh, our reopening and cinemas are reopening after a gap of uh, seven long months in the state of Maharashtra. Uh, today we are releasing, you know, a combination of Hindi and English movies. So all the... Marvel fans, all the, you know, James Bond fans who missed uh, uh, watching, you know, uh, No Time to Die, which uh, released few weeks back, Sanctuary, which got released few weeks back. Yes. So we are screening those movies uh, for the fans in Maharashtra who were deprived of those movies. Yes, like us. Oh, absolutely. So, so, so we, from starting now, we'll be screening those movies uh, for at least a couple of uh, weeks. Uh, 
uh, it would be all the Hollywood and the local biggies that will get released. Right. But good thing is that uh, starting Diwali, which is starting from uh, 5th of November, uh, we have all the Hollywood and uh, Bollywood biggies which are releasing. So the first biggie to release would be Surya Manshi, which is releasing on uh, uh, 5th of uh, November. Uh, after Surya Vanshi, in fact, every week uh, we have a, a biggie which is releasing. So in the month of November, we'll have the likes of Bunty Bubbly, we'll have Surya Vanshi. Uh, December, we have uh, biggies lined up like Ranveer Singh's uh, 83, which is based on the famous Dev 83 World Cup win that we had. Uh, we have uh, Jersey, uh, which is also releasing in the month of uh, December. In terms of Hollywood, you know, like I spoke, whilst we are releasing all the biggies, uh, this and is coming, yeah. Uh, there is Eternals, again, a Marvel Eternals franchise is which is releasing, which is a big franchise releasing in the week of Diwali. So that's something that will be releasing in the month of November. December, we have uh, biggies like Spider-Man and The Matrix, which is releasing across all the PBR cinemas. Right. Exciting, exciting lineup to look forward to. Exciting lineup and, you know, great that uh, you all are back uh, across the country now. So hoping this trend continues and this 50% eventually becomes 100% capacity and we can, you know, all sit together and enjoy the movies. Thank you so much. In fact, one thing that I would like to, if time permits, uh, what we have also done is that PBR has backed the rights of uh, screening the ICC T20 World Cup matches starting with the first much awaited India Pakistan match on uh, Sunday evening. Right. And happy to share with you that uh, we've got tremendous response uh, from our guests across all the PVR properties where we are screening these matches. Uh, as we speak, you know, almost 75% of the tickets are sold out across all these properties. Wow. That will be some experience. Absolutely. Great. So, all the very best. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much, Rohit. Thank you so much.